uh, the first few questions are just asking you, is this a function or is it not? So how do you tell if something's a function or not? Well, first you have to know what a function is. So a function is a special relationship where each input has a single output. A single output. That is the important part. Inputs are usually your x, are usually your independent variable. Independent variable. Um, your output, usually your y, usually your dependent variable. So every input, there is a single output, just one, no more. Single output. All right. So, let's, so here's a few tables. Are these functions or are they not? Well, what is a function? Each input has a single output. So here, x is your input. 3 has an output of 5. 3 has an output of negative 2. I can stop right there if I want, but 3 has an output of 1, 3 has an output of negative 3. These are all the very same input, and these are all different outputs. So this is not a function. Not a function. This one, 0, 4, 7, 6. These are all your inputs, 0, 4, 7, and 6. They all have an output of 1. Is that okay? The answer is yes, that is okay, because a function says that a single input can only have a single output, but these are all different inputs. And just because their output is the same is okay. That's fine, because these are all different inputs, so they still only have a single output, because they're all different. Here, same thing, um, 2, 5, 8, 1, they're all different, they all have a single output. So, there you go. How that looks on a graph, x, well where are your x's? Your x's are here, these are all your inputs, right? So how can I check if they have a single output or not? What is the output? The output's y. So if, say, 1, 2, 3, here's my input, right? This is my input. Then my output is my y. That's 1, 2, 2 and a half ish So that's a single input here. I don't have any other y value that goes for this x. Same here. Same here. But not the same here. If I choose, say, that looks like 3 fourths, I've got, let's change colors, I have this y value, I have this y value, I have this y value, that's one, two, three outputs for this, one input, this x, so that is clearly not a function. Um, let's check here, these are your x's, right, your x values, um, let's say I pick this one, I've got one y value, one y value, one y value, same here, all right? Just one, so this is a function. Doesn't matter that they're not connected. All that matters is that one x has one y. Here, 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 here. Again, these might even be the same. These look like they might be on the same line. They have the same output, the same y value. But that's fine, because we're only worried about the x. The input has to have its own. So a nice way to check that on a graph um, is called the horizontal line test or the pencil test, because really what you're doing is you're making a horizontal line. You can use a pencil, hence pencil test. Um, and you're going to grab it. Let me see if I can grab this gonna grab it and you're just gonna move across and if it touches more than one thing at a time then you know it's not a function in this case it never does so that one is a function in this case we're good we're good we're good we're good oh it touches uh, more than one output here so this is clearly not a function nice easy way to see that